Neighbors say they're still shook up after what they say started with an argument in the house just right behind me ended with Nicole Dinehart dead in the street. Now, one person we talked to actually knew Gage Dinehart, the son who allegedly shot and killed his mother. She says knowing Gage, this is something she just never could have imagined. A crime of passion. This uh, shocks law enforcement, it shocks the family, it shocks the neighborhood. I mean, this is just, it's just shocking. A woman who knows Gage Dinehart says he grew up with her kids being friends with them. For her, the crime is heartbreaking. I mean, killing somebody is a big thing, so, especially family, so it's just hard to believe it. She says he's a quiet, respectful person who grew up always on the run, in and out of homes, but never suspected he could do anything like this. He's just had a troubled life, like a lot of other people, and I just never thought that this would happen. Pleasant Grove police say they know the 21-year-old, saying Gage grew up running into problems with the police since he was a kid but never expected this. It is unusual that it's it's a son killing his own mother. That 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 doesn't happen. Neighbors in the area say they stayed up all night. They told ABC4 they're too spooked and scared of retaliation to speak on camera, saying they heard the mother and son fighting, the gunshots, and saw Nicole dead in the street. One neighbor says his wife heard the gunshot going to bed. He says things like this don't happen in Pleasant Grove. The big city, yeah, but not here. Now, the captain of the police department saying that he hopes Gage is held without bail so that these neighbors don't have to be scared of retaliation. He says that if Gage is convicted of this crime, he could be facing up to life in prison. Reporting in Pleasant Grove, I'm Ali O'Rulian, ABC4 News. Thank you.